in the past year, I've seen fools, fiendish foes, enemies of America make a mockery of America in our U.S. government, in our system of government, in our judicial system, at the Department of Justice, at the FBI, in Congress. Man, I wouldn't say across the board, but in a large part of our government, I've seen a bunch of motherfucking dirtbags, a bunch of motherfucking lowlifes, man, scumbags. These people, when I look at the America that I grew up in, and I compare, I compare and contrast it to this now time, this future timeline, which is now. When I look back 25 years ago, plus when I was in high school and looking at the future from high school, you had to be someone of character, man. You had to have some type of integrity. Nowadays, you don't get that from from these fucking peons, man, in our government a lot of times. You just have a lot of unscrupulous, unruly, ragtag, motley crew ass fools. People, man, who attend these fucking colleges where it's like a degree mill. They just get like churned out like butter in a butter factory. These people, man, are fucking clowns and stooges. I mean... It really is a Shakespearean play of losers. Man, these people who represent us supposedly, they're not, they're unrepresentative of me. They're non-representatives of me. I don't consider these fucking foolios, these clowns, these stooges, these dum-dums, these ding-dongs, these doorbells. These fucking people, man, that claim to be U.S. Congress, they're a bunch of fucking dirtbags, scumbags, and losers, in my opinion, in my view, because they have no scruples. They have no, they have no morals or values that I share, that we share, that are common. No, man, they're fucking lousy, bum ass. They're lousy, bum ass scums, man. They're fucking scummy ass bums. And they're stupid, man. They can't, man, I couldn't be at a party or anywhere in public or at at any type of private event, engagement, any type of function and have a conversation with these fucking morons. These people are senseless, pathetic, babbling, idiotic, moronic, peonic, fucking douchebag trashes, man. They're trashes. I mean, they really are, dude. If you, if you look at the shit that they, that they espouse, that they run their mouths about doesn't really have anything to do with reality, man. It's completely incongruent with reality. They're reality deniers. They create this fake reality. They create this fake ass fabricated manufactured reality that is bogus as fuck. They want all this shit to exist that can't possibly really truly exist in the real world. And these people are supposed to be officials. They're supposed to be leaders. I know what they really are. They're superficial. You know how, like, in high school you or college, you'd go to that party, and you'd try to, like, have an intellectual conversation with someone, and then within a few seconds, nanoseconds, microseconds, within a few milliseconds, you're like, yo, this motherfucking idiot, man, this fucking moron, this imbecile, this dude is hella dumb. This dick is a fucking... This dick is a box of rocks. Man, this dude is a dick. He's talking all this shit. He's a pseudo-intellectual. Or this fucking bitch, she's so stupid. She's stupid as fuck. Like, what a fucking idiotic, moronic bitch. You know what I mean? Just people who are pseudo-intellectuals. They're not really intellectuals. They go on and on ad nauseum about all this shit. That they want for you to think is like intelligent. That is like smart. And they want to sound all like studious and like scholarly. And they're just like, dude, the shit you're talking about is like a utopia that cannot exist. Can't have open borders. Can't just let people come over here and get amnesty. Can't just give benefits to people who are not U.S. fucking citizens, dude. It doesn't matter what country they fucking come from. 
Doesn't matter what goddamn fucking country they come from. Okay? Those are benefits for Americans who worked hard during their lifetime. During their lifetimes. Okay? You're not just going to be giving our shit to other motherfucking people. And the fact that these people haven't been ejected from Congress and from government and from the Department of Justice and other parts of our government, the fact that they haven't been 86th before now, it's just beyond fathomable, man. It's just unfucking fathomable. That's why we're here to do something about it. We're proactive. We're taking steps to rectify the situation. I want to grow. Thanks for tuning in.